Welcome to the Raider Cast, your podcast for everything silver and black. I am your host, JT, and this is another news video coming at you. We have our 85 player roster limit uh, being hit today. Uh, it was an expected, you know, some expected cuts. We were expecting cuts, but there was some unexpected cuts. Um, we're going from 90 to 85. One of the unexpected ones was Demarcus Robinson. Uh, obviously that's a bigger name that was a bigger name on our roster one of the bigger signings we made other than obviously you know the really big signings he was one of the more known signings one of the bigger somewhat gets of our offseason already being cut shows me that not only is uh, Tyron Johnson Mac Hollins and Keelan Cole showing up in camp and in games um, but also DJ Turner looked really good especially in these past few games as both a returner and as a wide receiver. And it looks like DeMarcus Robinson was just the odd man out right now. Did not really have a fit or a place in the offense. And so he got the cut. Um, it makes sense this early. That way you don't just string him along and just cut him, you know, two weeks from now and he struggles to find a team to, for the start of the season. Cut him now. He still has almost a little under a month to find a new team. So, you know, wish him all the best. Hope he finds a new team because he is, does, is not an untalented player. He just wasn't fitting with what we had going on here in Las Vegas. Um, another somewhat surprising cut for me anyway was Jerry Green. I wasn't necessarily high on him, but I wasn't expecting him to be cut this, especially this early. Um, he was kind of a, a practice squad, you know, bench body the past few seasons for us. Uh, but he looked decent, and our defensive end depth is already pretty thin. Um, and the only really depth we have beyond Kuntz, Furl, and Tashawn Bauer right now is our undrafted free agents, which have been playing pretty decently. So I'm my guess is that they saw him as kind of this middle ground of not really performing up to Kuntz and Tashawn Bauer's level or Furl's expected level and also isn't necessarily young enough to be developed um, as well as Zach Von Valkenberg and Myron Tangavailoa uh, Amosa can. So... He was kind of the odd man out in that group, so he got the cut. Looks like uh, Von Valkenberg and Tagovailoa Amosa will get the practice squad nod probably by the end of you know the cuts and stuff like that. They'll probably come back onto our roster. Um, and it looks like it's going to be Furl, Kuntz, and uh, Tashawn Bauer backing up Cleveland, uh, not, not Cleveland Furl, uh, Chandler Jones and Max Crosby. Uh, and then you have the others you know not necessarily expected but you know whatever cuts is tyron we tyrone wheatley jr who i believe his father was a former raider uh nate brooks who was here for a week and barely played any snaps and vernon butler uh vernon butler is a surprise ish maybe to some people but not really because he wasn't he's kind of old he hasn't played really that well since 2018 and I never even had him making the practice squad, so it makes sense to cut him now. Maybe he'll retire. Maybe he'll just find a new team because he is a veteran defensive tackle. And the only reason why I said I was a surprise at the earlier, uh, earlier, just now, <laughs> is because we are very thin defensive tackle, very not a very talent heavy part of our team. So having as many defensive tackles as possible to keep fighting for a roster spot. But I guess he just really did not show well at all, so he got the cut immediately. Um, yeah, so that's really all the cuts. That's all the cuts we have so far. Um, we could have more if we sign other players, um, cause there's other, obviously other teams that are cutting players. We might try to grab some from other teams and cut some of our own. So we'll have to stay tuned on that and I'll make videos as the cuts or additions or whatever comes. Um, thank you for tuning into this video. I hope you guys have a great day. Stay tuned for more videos coming up this week, more streams, uh, and more, Twitter stuff. <laughs> All right. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, Raider Nation.